Something I need to like drop down onto, I hope. It would make more sense to me to have to be up here to find something rather than to drop down again. Well, hello. I don't want to fight you, please. Please, please don't fight, don't fight me. Can't touch this. There's so much area here that I haven't explored, surprisingly. Just grabbing all these items that are just laying on the ground everywhere. It'll be helpful at some point, probably. Hopefully. This seems like an interesting spot. Like, if I was going to hide something, I think this is where I'd put it. There are so many items that I'm getting right now. So many. It's hard to keep up. Just give me a go up here as well, please. Stop getting stuck on random things. You're able to climb mountains and everything. So why is it so difficult? I hope there's nothing, like, in the middle of water that I need to go check. Like, it's just a stake in the middle of the sea somewhere. I'll never find any if they're like that. Why are there so many items? Why are there so many items here? Can you, like, fight the Pokemon for me? Thank you. That's kind of the point of having the Pokemon to fight the Pokemon is for them to actually fight the Pokemon and not the trainer. Send you out so I can grab that without getting into a fight. Also, I think if I'm not mistaken, I think I'd never talk to the guy again over at this Pokestop. So I'm gonna check that and then go back up and continue all the rest of the stuff. So many items. Been having some nice battles? Yes, probably. Five trainers. Here's your lovely prize. Earthquake TM. Okay, there we go. That's one of the things I mentioned at some point that I didn't really mention, but I mentioned it. So, uh, yeah, it's a cool, cool story, right? So why am I struggling right now? Can I go into this? Probably not. <laughs> I can, but I can't. But anyway. Let's head back up. Hey, what a terror shot times three. Just randomly. Hang on, is that a thing? Or is that just the beam? I think it's just the beam of light. The beacon. Everything looks the same. <laughs> Everything, all the items, stakes, beacons of terror raids. Everything. Looking for research participants. Aha, my hypothesis was correct. People in this region talk to each other to start battles. Well, not if the, they don't just initiate the fight themselves. Philippe, the scientist. Gulpen. You know, you know how it goes. Man, that was a long time ago <laughs> that we found a Gulpen in, in the beginning of the game. Oh, Gulpin avoided the attack. It's because I didn't do the full joke. I already did the joke, though. Like, forever ago. Also, how is this only level 17? How? When would I get here at level 17 to match its power with my own? Magnemite? I don't know, I'll just keep going. Only Surf is effective, so... But still, that's why we have different types of moves, so you can actually handle anything that comes up against you. I guess it's Paldi and Culture to approach other trainers and talk to them in, to engage in battles. It really feels like they were supposed to, at some point, initiate the battles on their own, just to fight you. But they don't, so I don't know, it's weird. It's very strange. Very strange indeed. I 
I don't know if I have that or not. I might, or I might, I might not. That's crazy, it's like all the scenarios in one. I might or I might not. It's crazy. Deep, deep thoughts. Hey, another trainer. There's so many of them. <laughs> Guess what's in my backpack? Is it another backpack? Nope, you have a Pokemon, okay. That was my second guess, Backpacker Kevin. Nope, that was a good fight. Good, good fight. Why does it take so long to get through all that? Just random text. Ah! I even packed up my best Pokemon. Level 17. Just, re just a reminder. Just a reminder. It was level 17. Is there anything over here that I need to think about? I think there was actually a stake here that I grabbed a while ago. So there probably wouldn't be any stakes near here, probably. An item. I don't need that. I think I explored this this higher ground area. Probably. Let me go up and check. Since there are places that I think I've been to that I haven't actually been to. Things I've done and seen across the world. You know, it's kind of weird roaming around like this because this isn't really. Improving my Pokemon at the moment, but I'm I mean I'm getting a little bit done to my Pokedex, but that's about it I don't think I've been on that area. Have I? This random rock in the middle of the thing because I wouldn't have thought to go up here So I definitely haven't been up here yet Unless I have by just climbing up normally On a ramp or something a terrain ramp It's not a psychic terrain ramp, but you know So we're definitely over there, but not up here. There is nothing up here. I'm glad that I was so interested by this this area that I just, there's nothing here. It's fine. It'd be a real shame if there was a stake just inside of this Team Star base somewhere that I have to find. I don't think there is, but you never know. Can I talk to you? Nope, apparently not. Well, I tried, so... It's the best I can do. I'm assuming that there has to be like a, a bubble above the head if I can talk to them or not. Quite possibly. Because those, those, those people, the Team Star trainers I saw at that one other spot... That I could actually get... Some, some of their gear from, so... Maybe there's more of that somewhere, but I don't know. I don't know where. Some fresh water. Nice. Please climb. Why so hard to climb? Hang on. Is there something over there? Is there something up there? It doesn't look like it. It's a shame. There's so many places that you could hide stuff, and it's just not. I feel like I've been doing a pretty good job of exploring recently, but I, don't, I guess not. I guess I said I was gonna actually check some of those, um... Shrines to see if there's anything... ...new to see. So, hello. Just a random Persian. Per per Persian? I don't know. I need to w watch the cartoon to find out... ...what pronunciation of everything there is because they all say their own names so I guess that's the easiest way to find out I just saw double I'm pretty sure that's fun it's probably fine 
doubt there's anything over here that I need to worry about. I, they're like just right up against the edge of the great crater. There's probably nothing else. We probably could have seen this earlier, probably, possibly, maybe. I don't know. It was better to not, though. Pretty sure we've been, already been up this way, so I don't think I need to worry about this area too much. Yeah, I was definitely already here. Uh, let me go somewhere else. <laughs> I'm like, probably not that far away from what I actually need to be at to find the other stake, but I'm just gonna go somewhere else. Just wanna look at that shrine, if I can. See what that's all about. How much is left for it and all that. Also, hey, you haven't been having some nice battles? Um, I don't think I have enough. I think I need like one more. No, I need two more. Did I not fight this trainer over here? No, I didn't. Pro wrestling? <laughs> what are you talking about? You youngins call the, that flashy sport pro wrestling, right? Is that, is it popular among your set these days? What are you talking about? What are you, what are you talking about? Anna Maria, the student. Sent her Gengar. I need to get a Gengar, but I have to find one, which is unlikely. I have to trade to get one, so the, I have to trade a, um, I wanted to evolve it, so. It's fine. Can I please attack? That'd be nice. Oh wow, it's still alive. It's a ghost Pokemon and it's still alive. That's better. We need to find one other trainer in this area to actually get the reward, so. Make a drain. Do regret rid of growth, please do do. What am I doing? Nothing. Okay. I was just confusing myself, it's fine. I think this is fine, right? Yeah. I mean it's not incredible, but it's fine. I just need to hopefully not um have my Pokemon faint because otherwise it's going to be one of the really weak Pokemon that I'm trying to train up to evolve. I forgot I have the Terrestrialization. I can only use it once between heals at Pokemon Center, so I'm not really going to use it much, sadly. I don't want to waste it. Oh, well, there we go. Something wants to learn Supersonic, which I think confused the enemy. Yes, confused the target. Anything that I also don't really need? Lowers their speed. Could be helpful. Uh, stunning them is possibly more helpful. Uh, side Beam also just confuses them, so I don't know. I could just leave it as it is. Realistically, so. And Supersonic has a 55% chance, so I'm just gonna get rid of that, I think. As helpful as it might be. Grassy terrain. Powers up grass type moves, that could be good. Flail is actually a pretty good move, but I don't know if I want to keep that. Absorb. I've got, got Mega Drain, so I should probably just get rid of Absorb. It seems you are. You are a pro at Pokemon battles. Okay. But why were you saying wrestling before? Gibble's evolving into the other one we've already seen. But I, had, I traded that one away, so I need to get this one to evolve to the full level. If I can. I don't know what my strategy is for figuring out which Pokemon I need to evolve by trade or by stones. My, my current strategy is just to get as much as I can without doing anything special and then figuring it out from there. Also, there's a lot of this area that I didn't explore, which is interesting. Also, I think the thing, I think the thing is up here, right? Yeah. 
Also, hello. There's a blue stake here. Is that... Oh, I see. Interesting. Well, let me grab this one. So there's a thing in the cave below me, I believe. Is the thing that's going on here. But it's very interesting to find it right next to it. Right above it, actually, so... Please grab... The waterfall TM, thank you. Ah... Uh, no, it is. <laughs> Whoa, look at this place. So many Pokemans. Also have... Like, half of them. So I need, like, four more blue stakes or something. Can I stop getting stuck on things? Every time I touch the edge of the water, I... I fly around the wrong way. It looks like there's an area down there I need to explore as well. It looks like, um... Waterfall was originally supposed to be an ability for Coridon. Based on how many waterfalls there are that you have to go to the top of, sometimes. At least there, it seemed like that. I mean, you can climb up there, which is how, how I did it. But it seems like there was supposed to be another way that you are supposed to do that. Quite possibly. I mean, Waterfall was at the top of the waterfall as well, so... I don't know. It doesn't really make sense. Hiya! Ra! I got my black belt through an online course. Fernando the black belt. Sent out Toxicroak. And I sent out Dragonite. Well, let's hurricane this. It's super effective. Very nice. Scary face, I probably don't need. Actually, lower the speed stat. I don't think I need it. Could be helpful, but anyway. It's fine. Inner focus, intimidate. Hurricane. Oh, is it miss? It avoided the attack. How dare you? Swagger. Dragonite is confused. Also, I can click the right stick to fix the camera, apparently, because sometimes it just breaks all the time. Please, hit them. Hit, hit the Pokemon. Hit the Pokemon. Confused and not hitting accurately. There we go. Super effective, critical hit. Gallade. What's a Gallade? What's a Gallade again? Remind me. Oh, that's a Gallade. That's cool. Draining Kiss. 50 power, 100 accuracy. My go string shot. Seed bomb. 80 power, 100 accuracy. Why did I get grassy terrain? I guess I am going with that, so. Um, I could get rid of Mega Drain. Probably. Wait, this stuff is way harder in real life. <laughs> cool. Very cool. Oh, hey, Smoliv is evolving. I remember the first time we saw a Smoliv. I thought it was a different Pokemon, I'm pretty sure. I don't know what Pokemon I thought it was, but I thought it was a different Pokemon, I'm pretty sure. Dolive. Grass normal. Just 
just like how it's continually nodding at me after the end of the fight. See if there's anything else down here that we can find. Maybe. I like this area. Like, it, it's the most enclosed area in the game and it feels better than the open areas. Is that weird to say? I don't know. Like, they, it was like, cool to have an open world thing. Rock slide TM. But also, somehow this is more interesting to me. Having some amount of limitation. Because I, I actually have paths I can follow. That makes sense. Wow. Falling. Falling fast. Is that a cave over there? I think it's just a rock and I'm pretty sure I've already been over there. Uh, let me check the map to see if there's anything else I need to think about. Over here. I don't know if I've been up here, so I could go up further. Possibly. If in doubt, climb. Hey, there's a gimme ghoul here. So let's dance TM. Gonna Dragon Pulse, I guess. I don't know. It's level 50, but that's fine, so. Give me the money. 50 gimme go coin. Gonna keep exploring a little bit more around here to make sure I'm not missing anything. Because this is the blue stake territory, so I could it could be. Or it might not be, which is also very likely as well. I think I explored not here. Yeah, because this is a weird terrain to get through here. It's my best description of it. Gonna pick these up. XP Candy S, XP Candy Cast, uh, XS, a M and L. Cool, so all just random XP Candies. Of various types. There's a lot of items just everywhere. It really doesn't expect you to get them all. And yet I still keep trying to get as many of them as I can. This is an interesting spot. Hyper Voice TM. So this is above from the ruin that we have explored ages ago. It's always cool to think about that. Just the areas that are nearby that you couldn't reach until now. Or until much later. But they're still so close. I don't think there's anything else done there. Hopefully. Whilst this music's being very cool quite like it. I'm pretty sure I have one of you. As much as I should probably be fighting those to get more XP candy. Please go up. Thank you. Wild charge. TM. I'm glad there are, there are so many TMs just to find, so you don't run out of them. Take care of you. Seed bomb. Anything else around here that I need to know about? Maybe. I think, I, f I feel like I'm close to a stake. Because I feel like I'm out in the middle of nowhere. There's not a ton of stuff here. We can we have a, a large view of the world from here, so I, I feel like, surely, please. Must be must be close, right? Have I been here before? Am I crazy? Maybe.
Dragon Pulse TM. Cool. Very cool. Maybe this is the place I thought was the place for better training. I don't know. Well, hey, there's Dragonite here. Trustlized. There's also a giant rock that leads to nothing, nowhere. We can't climb because it doesn't exist or something. Well, I can climb the ground next to the rock, but not the rock itself. Cool. Cool. So I guess this is going to be an important place later on. Maybe that's why you have to climb your way up here, is the, the path for it has been made into a path yet. Maybe eventually once the DLC is released or something, it'll become a path up instead of just climbing. So I guess no stakes here then. Unless I'm just bad at looking with my eyes in places that they sh I should be looking. I'll grab this. There's like three left, probably, of the blue ones. If I'm guessing correctly. Otherwise there's just four left. <laughs> and still be pretty close. Give me the Gimme Ghoul. It's like right there. Come on. There we go. Five Gimme Ghoul coins from just that. Wow. We found another one. Found two more stakes since I started looking. I found like three stakes in this hour then, or pulled out three stakes in this hour. I already knew where one of them was, but still. I'm trying my, my hardest to find more. Definitely have one of those. Need to pay attention to this area around here. Some more. I was right to come here to explore because I, there's definitely parts of this that I thought I had explored, but I definitely hadn't. I knew I hadn't, so. Hey, there's a thing in this little spot. Heavy slam TM. There's another TM up here as well. So many items in every direction. Also, that thing just disappeared. Zen headbutt. Full restore. It's always pretty good to find more of those. Hey, Jeremy! Great to see you, Jeremy. Did you come to train with me? Ah, uh, yes. I'm always ready to battle. Let's see if you can handle my full power. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. My Pokemon are still bad. I guess we can go to all the Team Star bases and do some more training. I thought that the icons on the map looked slightly different, so I... Maybe? I don't know. Right then, Jeremy, hope you're ready for a good, proper battle. No, I'm not. Thank you for asking. Oh, look at you! 60, level 65. Hurricane. Probably avoided the attack. I really should have known better. But I thought it was... I didn't realize who I was talking to. I thought it was a random person. You have five Pokemon. Rock slide. I am dead. That's fine. Now that I know, it's fine. But maybe I can survive this. Maybe with one Pokemon I can live through this entire fight. Because that's all I can hope to do. Uh, switch Pokemon. That sounds like a good plan. I mean, it's not incredible, but it is a plan. I don't think I'm going to fight with another Pokemon, but I can at least use them as a heal bait. <laughs> that's, that's the term I'm going with. I could have picked a better term, I don't know. A heal decoy. I mean, it's basically the same thing. Do that. It means I'm not wasting a turn and having to heal again. Because they faint, and then I can switch back again. Hopefully not take too many more hits, because that'll be bad. Oh, I'm out of that. Right, I should have thought about that. I'm out of both of those. Uh, Dragon Pulse. Please, let me live. Please hit, please hit, please hit, thank you. I could spend two Pokemon to 
restore my um, power points as well as my health, so. But also, if I can actually, um, I don't know, if I can actually ha have a Pokemon stay alive for two turns, that'd be pretty good. Annihilate. I really should have thought this through, but it's fine. This is what I do, as I make mistakes and I learn from it. Uh, Max Elixir? That seems like a good plan, actually. Although I think there's something else I should have done, but it's fine. Close combat, super effective. How much health does my Pokemon have now? My Dragonite. Uh, not a ton, so I'm gonna spend another turn to heal. I mean, it does have a fair bit of health, but it goes it goes through it very quickly. So I think I should probably be doing this right. It'd be more ideal to have something that does more than that. But I don't think there is anything, so I'm just gonna max potion this. I could possibly even use revives <laughs> to try and make this l l fight last longer. That's what I really should be doing, instead of using a turn to heal, is use a turn to revive if I need to. That way I can last a bit longer, probably. But it's fine. I could also heal with my Dragonite to try and make this last longer as well. Something that's important to learn in Pokémon is just extension tactics to make the fight last longer, so you don't die. Or less likely to die, maybe. Though it's it's a it's a bit of a gamble game. We sacrifice one thing for something else. I'll keep current Pokemon. Should have possibly done something else, but this is the best I can do. And if I can get a critical hit, that'd be great too. Hey, I confused him. That's good. If you can be, if you could hit yourself, that'd be great. Because otherwise, I might get destroyed in one shot, possibly. Please, nope. No, I'm good. <laughs> Wonderful. How is this fight working? I went into this without my actual team. And I'm managing this with one Pokemon, so that's pretty good. Drill Peck. Okay. <laughs> I might even have to. I might even better use my other Pokemon because they're leveling up so fast. Ah, uh, Drill Peck. 80 power, 100 accuracy. I'm gonna get rid of this one because it Fury Attack does hit multiple times, but I'm probably just gonna want the that one, especially because it's gonna have the stab bonus. So, Pezzamine. I focus best when I'm on a, in a tight spot. I'll show you I can still win. Well, I also focus pretty well when I'm in a tight spot. So we're this is a battle. <laughs> this is a fight. Okay. Uh, Hurricane. This has worked out somehow. How does this? How? I, I was expecting to lose and have to refi. <laughs> I did it. In a whole like seven, eight minutes or something like that. With one Pokemon. Basically. I mean, not actually one Pokemon, but enough of one Pokemon to survive. I don't like losing, but you're a strong one. One Pokemon plus heal decoys. That was a great battle. Thank you so much for sparing me. Sp sp sparring with me. Hasta la vista. Hey, I got money. That's pretty good. Does it actually mark that off again, or is, am I... Am I good? I don't know. Because the... It looks like it's, it's still a available, but I think it's just... Training, I guess. Which, that's actually not a bad thing to know about. After the, the end of the game. Just being able to have those fights... To... Improve your Pokemon strength. And just... Get stronger is... That's actually going to be very helpful for me. Fling. TM. Obviously there are better ways to grind, as the community will no doubt, no doubt point out, but... It's... if you want to just be casual about how you grind, you can just do it like that, I guess. Or just do lots of terror raid battles, which is probably what I would do. Just get all of the money and LP and stuff at the same time. There's a lot of items here. But anyway, that's probably it for now. 
I can just get around this platform. Anyway, so thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time.